For today I've got a super quick one day build. Most of my work now that I'm working remotely happens on my MacBook and a lot of that actually has to be stored on an external hard drive. I'm running out of room. So very similar to the pedal board, what I did was put some Velcro on the back, stuck it to the back of my MacBook. The problem is leads. I've got my lead that plugs in here and most of the time it's plugged in when I'm using it. If not, it's loose and like all USBs it's going to get snapped, it's going to get broken. So what I'm looking to do is print off probably a couple of clips there to hold it in place and maybe one up here on the, on the crack in my case so I can just store this out of the way when not in use so I don't use it, so I don't lose it or break it and so it doesn't just keep sitting randomly on the table in front of me. So hopefully this will be a really quick project. I'll CAD something up, throw it onto the printer and give it a test. So looking at a very cluttered workflow, I drew up the actual design, the model on SolidWorks, sent it down to my MacBook, which I've got Cura on, so the latest version of Cura, and from there, sent it across to the printer and printed off the first couple of samples. Now for these, I used PLA, which was probably a mistake. Would have been nicer to use a TPU rubber or something, but again, we're quick project, it's what I had to hand. And unfortunately, he says while it tries to focus quickly, zoom, the opening doesn't quite fit. It's too tight, it's going to damage the cable. So you'll notice the files, rather than redoing it, here's one I filed earlier. And what I've got is I've got a nice clip that's got some retention in it but allows the cable to freely move through it so hopefully we get this to focus so nice and smooth easy to pop in holds it quite well so it's time to make two more of these now all three are filed I made them an inch wide so I'm hoping to use some regular double sided tape just to bond them on. I do like this stuff, it's really good. So let's see if we can peel some off, get it started. And what I'm gonna do is gonna Okay, so let's get these bonded on. And let's start laying this out. So, scoot out a little bit. Now what I'm hoping to do is have this plugged in, perhaps a couple of them there. So, maybe one there and one there to hold it in line so it will come off at a nice angle to plug in and then a third one up top to seal it so let's give this a go that's a nice clip and that's a nice clip so start with the one with the easy pull tab let's plug us in put him down Ooh. okay Time for a second one. Let's see how this goes. So, try and keep this as straight as possible. So, maybe there. Perfect. So, when I open up my MacBook, I can easily get to it. Perfect. So now, that we've got those in place. This third one, how does he fit? He could sit about there. It fixed my crack and hold it into position quite well. And there we have it. That was a super quick, super simple one day build. Got a nice catch on here that means I can plug in my cable as and when required. And when not, they're all stored on it. It's not going anywhere, I'm not going to lose the cable. So, 
thank you for watching. I hope this was slightly interesting and I hope that you all design every day. Keep it all going and I love to see what you're up to. Thanks a lot.